In this video today, guys, I'm going to be showing you how you can boost your FPS, reduce your input delay, and overall improve your PC's performance by this simple-to-use application. This is the Ronin Tweaks Lite. It is an application that will allow you to fully optimize your PC with just a few clicks. And the best part about it is that it is 100% free. They also do have a premium version. Make sure you go ahead and check that out as well. Anyways, without further ado, let's get right into the video. Alright guys, so for the first thing I want to go ahead and do is you want to go ahead and join the Discord channel that I'm going to leave down below in the description, which is going to redirect you to Ronin Tweaks' official Discord server. Once you're in this Discord server, you want to go ahead and scroll a little bit down until you find the download channel right here, and you want to go ahead and visit the Ronin Tweaks Lite website. This is also going to redirect you to Ronin Tweaks' official website, where you can easily download the free utility. But to do this, you want to go ahead and head back over to the Discord server, you want to go to bot commands, and you want to do exclamation mark free. Once you go ahead and do this, the Ronin Tweaks bot is going to DM you with the code, so you want to go ahead and copy paste the code. You want to go ahead and paste this code right here, and you want to click on verify. Then you want to go ahead and verify your YouTube channel, and you want to press on download now. Once you press on download now, you may get a notification saying that this is a virus or it's malicious. You want to head back over to Ronin Tweaks' Discord server. Then you want to head over to is this a virus and you want to go ahead and read this right here. It's basically going to explain what are false positive detections. You then want to go ahead and open the Ronin Tweaks installer and you may get a message saying this. You just want to go ahead and press some more info and click on run anyway. Then you want to go ahead and press on yes. Then you want to go ahead and press on install. And as you guys can see, it's installing right here. Then you want to go ahead and open the Ronin Tweaks Lite application. Once you go ahead and open it, you want to go ahead and press on accept. Make sure you go ahead and create a system restore point because this allows you to revert any changes if needed. As you guys can see, this is how Ronin Tweaks Lite looks like. Here you have a small help or a guide. Anyways, as you guys can see, here you have your performance monitors, your CPU, your GPU, your RAM, your disk, and your net. You have your hardware information and your system information. And here you have all the different tweaks that you can apply. So first, we have Optimize Windows. This is basically going to optimize your windows for better performance. Then you have 132 Process Separation. This is basically going to optimize process scheduling and IRQ priorities. Then you have disable game bar this is basically going to disable xbox game bar then you have disable power throttling now if you have a laptop i do not recommend you apply this then you have optimized multimedia game priorities make sure that you have this turned on this is basically going to optimize your mmcss priorities then you have disable specter slash meltdown migrations make sure that you apply this as well because this is going to optimize your cpu and fortnite is obviously a cpu based game then you have disable notifications not really necessary then you have disable exclusive full screen make sure that you turn this on then you have disable background services and telemetry make sure that you have this turned on as well then you have system responsiveness optimization make sure that you have this turned on then you want to go ahead and disable hpet which is basically the high precision event timer and you want to go ahead and optimize your windows timer resolution then you have some cpu tweaks you want to go ahead and apply some intel cpu optimization or amd as well but if you're on laptop, I do not recommend that you apply any of these because this may increase power consumption. Anyways, you have some GPU tweaks as well. Make sure that you go ahead and apply the NVIDIA GPU optimization. Disable GPU thermal throttling. If you're on laptop, obviously do not apply this. But if you have a good cooling system, then make sure that you apply this. Disable dynamic P states. Make sure that you turn this on. Optimize shader cache. Make sure that you have this turned on as well. You also do have phantom boost. This is basically going to optimize any running process with advanced fine tuning for CPU priority. So let's say you have anything opened right now. So let's say you have Fortnite opened, for instance. You just want to go ahead and press on it aggressive and you want to go ahead and press on optimize this is basically going to optimize your fortnite in real time then you have the d bloater right here and then that's all and that is it for today's video guys if you enjoyed make sure you like share comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video